Thank y'all for stopping by my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell if you'd like to be notified as I drop my videos. So let's do this. Um, first, I want to say uh, some prayers up for Tamia Taylor of Memphis, Tennessee. Praying that she um, is found alive. Tamia, most of y'all have probably heard of her. She's a 21-year-old female out of Covington, Tennessee, who went missing, I think, like over in the middle of the night. So it would be like 10. Because on the night, she went to go meet three friends at Memphis Riverboats to celebrate her 21st birthday. Um, her mom received a text about 9.30 saying that she had made it to Memphis. Um, then she received another text text about 11.39 that she said like around 11.39 and said she was on the boat but she never got off the boat the departure was I think like 10.30 was to board or depart anyway it was supposed to arrive back to be docked at 1.30 a.m. Um, Tamia have not been seen she has not been seen since then and the three friends that she was with I'm going to say allegedly for all of this, the three friends that she was with don't seem to be true friends. Um, they first said that she didn't get on the boat, but that's not true because um, <laughs> there's a video of her in, in the boat dancing. So y'all be the judge of that. Is it on the boat or off the boat? Science, but it really doesn't take that to notice that she's on a boat like she's in somewhere and she tested her mom and said she was on the boat but i will say tamia looked a little intoxicated which hey her 21st birthday celebrate maybe she had a designated driver maybe one of the three was supposed to drive her back home i'm not sure but they came out next and said that she went to the restroom on the second floor. Well, on the second level. And she laid her phone down. She was gone for a few minutes and she never came back down. It's strange because a 21-year-old female, they don't leave their phones like that too much, especially when they're out. I mean, it just don't happen. But then that's kind of like, it could possibly be a twist in this as well. During my research, I found out that Miss Tamia Taylor is the best friend of Marnisha Wynn's daughter and has been since elementary school. Now, for the people who don't know who Darnisha Wynn is, that's the lady that was shot along with Anita Wilson, who... Um, was unalive. She she didn't make it on the I mean not November the twelfth, five days before dawn. So I'm saying to say this. Okay, this could be a, a a few different things. This could be one of those cases where hey, it's getting close to trial. Darnisha possibly probably gonna be a witness. I mean the way that they chopped her up, I I mean, I can understand why, but um, it could be one of those things where, okay, we can't get her, so we'll get someone she loves. Well, Darnisha do have a son, and she has a daughter. The daughter, I think, went to the military, and the son may be going to college by now. The next best thing would, probably, would possibly be Tamia. Because she's a young lady, been in the family, basically, you know, best friends since elementary. That's family. Or it could be one of them things where, because I, put, I did pull an article from June of this year of um, human trafficking and sex trafficking in Memphis, where they arrested some people. And they said she never came off the boat. Um, then there was a guy who came out. He was a, a cart taxi, golf cart taxi. Kind of like, but he said that she got off the boat, 
evidently, because she was with three people. He didn't state, you know, a lot of details about it, but she was with three people. What if it's one of those things where one of those three friends um, could have been friends or, you know, family of the ox? And, hey, we're trying to, you know, clear the room, trying to clear this out. So it's like a whole lot of stuff behind it. And I'm going to do more research because it's something that's really off. I have a strong feeling that this, that this young lady is still alive. But I think it's going to be one of them cat and mouse games. At least I pray she's still alive. I'm um, 21. Um, I pray for her mom because I know she's probably going through it. I know she has to be going through it. Um, Darnisha also posted where Miss Taylor has a cash app. And if anyone wants to donate anything, the cash app is on you know, one of the clippings on this video, Deborah Taylor, I think, dollar sign, De Deborah Taylor. And, you know, anything, I guess, would be appreciated. But then I have someone else said that they just seen them get off the boat when they was parked at the river. Car rolling up, they were going to their car. So, did she make it to the car? And something like, what happened to this young lady? It's sad. This young lady has kids. She just made her 21st birthday. And her mom is worried. So if anyone know anything, call Memphis PD. Because her mom needs answers. Her kids need to see their mom. I'm, I'm going to wrap this video up because I'm about to go and pull this, you know, some more info that I was looking into last night. But I really appreciate y'all for bearing with me, for watching my videos, taking that time out of, you know, your day. And I'm going to talk to y'all in a little bit. Peace out.